Check mic. Yeah, and good morning everyone. Pasensya na had to uh medyo delayed tayo ngayon. I'm still having issues with some of my internet and now Facebook is work. I mean, YouTube is working again. So I'm <laughs> transferring my live again sa ano tawag diyan sa sa YouTube. Yeah. Hopefully marami pa rin tayong mga ano. Marami pa rin tayong mga viewers. Yan, sa mga hindi pa nang pag-subscribe sa YouTube ko, this is your chance. Yan, ba- balik YouTube naman tayo. Um Thank you so much for the patience and pasensya na talaga. I do my own technicals here, everything, so microphones, cameras, and everything. Yeah, um, it's kind of multitasking. But then again, uh, that's not the point. The point is to help everyone, diba? So, tuloy pa rin tayo. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Laika. And today, we're going to be talking about um, PSEI, ano nangyari kahapon, and MRC and b Yan, yeah, yun yung topics ko ngayon. I'm gonna show you something kay MRC, kahit pula yan yesterday. So, yeah, uh, but before that, uh, well, let's wait for everyone. Yan. Yan, so, um, yan, yes, YouTube Live. I'm gonna be reading everyone's comments. I think mas maganda naman, uh, um, I think mas maganda naman siguro dito sa YouTube. Kaso nga lang, mas makonti yung audience natin dito. So, I'm gonna be asking for your help. Please share this video to your, uh, on your walls kasi, um, yan, uh, I this is the thing I've noticed kasi konti lang yung mga tao bas pag basta sa YouTube ko uh, basta sa YouTube ako nagla live but hopefully hopefully marami pa rin um, please share the video yun lang yung request ko sa inyo para dumami tayo dito lalaki yung community mas marami yung Pilipino na what do you call this um ang hirap talaga mag Tagalog Um, there will be more Filipinos who will be uh, inspired to get into the stock market and start start investing para naman mag-sustain ang market natin. But not just that, but def- definitely for financial freedom, di ba? Um, the, one of the main reasons why, uh, one of the main reason why ang daming natatakot sa stock market na Pilipino is because they don't know what they're doing and they don't have any idea. Let's, sh- let's, sh- let's show them that there are programs like these na who's willing to help them Uh, in their stock market journey. At least, makapagsimula man sila mag-test by man lang, maliit lang, kahit maliit lang naman, it starts there and then once they are starting starting to gain, ma-inspire yan sila mag-i- mag-ipon and add more once they are earning already. Yan. Um, so, I'm gonna read everyone's comments. Bibilisan ko lang kasi medyo late tayo nakapag-start. Emmanuel test chat. Uh, good morning. Yeah, guys, Um, if ever hindi kayo comment dito, it means that you don't have a channel yet. You have to create a channel in your YouTube para comment naman kayo. So, if you have any request na pwede natin i-chart, gusto nyo i-chart, ipa-chart sa akin, and just put it in the comments. I'm gonna play, be placing all my top picks now and all the relevant links dito. Um, give me one minute. All right. So, these are my top picks for today. Ito yung discuss natin. Yan. So guys, um just for your information, my super chat jan um nakikita niyo diyan sa chat room may parang dollar sign. If you want to donate and um for and help the channel, uh you can do that, right? So that's one way of helping uh, financial freedom 101. Um uh your chat will be highlighted on the chat mauna, mapaprioritize ko yan kasi ma-highlight yung chat niyo diyan. All right, Mark Cortez Um, good morning, Sir Lloyd and Laika. Good morning, Nax. Naka-YouTube live na. Right. L- Jay Legaspi, good morning, Sir Lloyd and Laika. Good morning then Maria Chona Bautista. Hello, good morning. Bull and Bear, good morning, Sir Lloyd. YouTube live is back. Yes, indeed. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Pwede ba ba bumili ng SEB, ICT, URC? Um, kahit mataas ng price na. Pwede naman. SEB, I, uh, SEB and URC are blue chips. Pwede kayong get in there. If you want to get in there, get in as an investor. Pwede kayo mag-cost averaging dyan. If ever it goes down, you just buy more. Uh, but for trading, medyo mahirap yung mga ganyan na position. Seb is okay. Ang ganda ng galaw ni Seb lately. I've been recommending Seb for how many days now, di ba? So, at saka si ICT din naman. Um, okay naman yung mga galaw niya. Uh, pwede nyo i-trade si ICT. Kaso nga lang, medyo mataas na nga lang. Yun yung problema. Right? Ray Darwin Dantes, good morning. Uh, Grace Rio, good morning, sir. Good morning then. Ray Darwin Dantes, low budget trader here. Ah, ikaw pala si low budget trader sa chat, chat room natin. Oo oh, nga pala, guys. Um, chat room natin. Um, andyan. Uh, nasa, ano, nasa description ng video. I hope you can see it. Uh, let me share my screen. Uh, two. Ayan. So, this is the chat room. 
Right, so ito yung chat room natin. Um, if you haven't joined yet, if you're a newbie and haven't joined the chat room yet, download Discord. This is called the Discord right here. Yan. Uh, once you've downloaded, yung, yung nasa description na link, check the video description. Merong ano dyan, Discord group. Uh, just search for it and automatically you'll be able to get into the chat room. Right, this is how the chat room looks like. Uh, yun. Um, it's a very helpful chat room. Maraming gusto, uh, maraming nagtutulong dito, nagtutulungan. Yan. Um, and then we have guides, daily recommendations, and dito nyo, dito nyo makikita. We have books here available whenever, if you ever you want to look for books, and napakaraming books dito. This is a treasure chest right here. Uh, charting discussions, um, PSE daily updates. I think it's important, isang importante. Um, while you're trading, this is updated to kanina, just 8:13 a.m nagpalabas si Sir Tech ng ano ng mga disclosures and lahat ng mga disclosures updated kay while trading and while communicating with other good traders right here so this is a very good community for you um, magandang tulong ito sa inyo guys so definitely check this out um, download Discord if you're a newbie this will be a good uh, this will be uh, a good community for you to try syempre nagsisimula pa lang kayo I'm not always there so other people can help you too right um, yun asa na ako uh, uh, please share the video. Yes, please share the video. Yun yung hingi, hiling ko sa inyo. 222 viewers na tayo ngayon. Good morning sa inyo lahat. Sa mga kakapasok lang, please share the video. RD de la Cruz, wow, YouTube na yan. I had no choice sa sirai FB. Eh. Mas gusto, uh, actually, mas gusto ko sa FB kasi andun na nakatira ang mga tao, right? Whenever I do updates, na nanonotify sila. But today, I had no choice. But ang gusto ko naman sa YouTube is I can put ads here. So, at least, um, I'm gaining something in return naman. But dun sa FB, mas marami tayo natutulungan kaya nag-transfer ako sa FB. But anyway, still, um, kahit ano naman, kahit ano medium naman, as long as we're helping. Yan. Um, J. Legaspi, A-L-I-S-M-P-H. I'm gonna write that down. Uy, nagbabagsa ka ng blue chips ka po. Yesterday was, grabe, napakadugo ng market yesterday. Kaya nag-sidelines lang ako. Uh, Nag-gardening lang ako. <laughs> In the afternoon, I was just sleeping. Nayaan ko muna yung mga positions ko because I know it's just the market sentiments that's doing it. Um, I know, anyways, Bruno Clown, hello. Uh, Alan Ibarbia, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Good morning then. Jonas, I, I hope the microphone's Okay, let me just um, turn on my audio for a bit. Other people can help you too. Right? Um, yan. Yan, clear naman. Alright. Um, Alan Ibarbia, good morning. Jonax Dantes, R.D. De La Cruz, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Laika and Miss Apple. And to my daughter, good morning. And she's already five years old. Argel Mendoza, good morning, Sir Lloyd. BDO, BPI. Thanks. I'm gonna write that down. Actually, BDO is in my top picks today. Um, BPI naman, uh, no, wala siya sa pick ko. So, I'm gonna write that down. BPI. Alright. So, next up, uh... David Gel, good morning. Jolie Garis, good morning, Sir Lloyd and Larka. Thank, thank you. Uh, so na ako. Oy, biglang bumaba. Ayan. Um, Eliser, Lauren, yay, free data sa Globe by YouTube. I see. So, maganda, yun pala yung ano sa ano, uh, yun pala advantage ng YouTube. Ayan, from, from Eliazar. Right? Um, MC Butete, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Or please, thanks si Or naman. Ayan, let's talk about Or. Uh, Ang uh, recommendation ko talaga kay Or is buy on the dips and if you think you're happy with the climb, then sell half and then yun, on the dips again, it's dipping again and we can buy more. Maganda pa ang future ni Or. Uh, ang dami pang projects niya na kami na hindi pa lumalabas sa mga disclosures. Kaya mag-accumulate na kayo habang maaga pa. Maria Chona Bautista, magandang umaga pa. Good morning din. Uh, Eugene Padua, uh, good morning sir. How about food? Yun, si food. Nare-recommend ko yun kahapon. Kaso nga lang bumagsak. Let's talk about it again today. Um, it's still above MA20. So, okay pa naman so far. Um, Eugene Padua, yun. Tapos na. Tuna Hunter, nice. Balik YouTube. Yun. Um, I think gusto ng mga tao sa YouTube. Ah. Siguro may, I'll be uh, using YouTube. Uh, in the future na lang. Kaso nga lang, konti ng watchers natin dito sa YouTube. Eh. Yun yun yung problema ko. So, I'm gonna be asking for your help. Please, share the video on your Facebook walls para malaman ng mga tao uh, yan, uh, malaman ng mga tao na may program na ganito to help them. Right, um, Aga, Seven Midas, uh, yun, good morning. Ay, ganda ng apelido, ah, Midas. Yan. Nakakayaman yan. Um, done sharing, sir. Thank you, Mac. Um, Marian Kalau. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Your thoughts on IDC, please. Uh, let's talk about IDC. Maganda naman si IDC eh. Kaso nga lang, major risk in position. If you're an investor in IDC, you can get in 
but I strongly recommend get in at a retracement. Ay, antayin nyo lang yung tra- retracement before you get you get in kay IDC. Kasi ma- mataas-taas na bagsak yan if ever it goes down to support, which is that's the main nature of the market. You have all to always keep that in mind. Uh, you don't know when the uh, if the market is gonna go back or or down or back up, diba? But usually after these exaggerated movements, bumabagsak yan. Kapon, I think that was the retracement of IDC. IDC. So another missed opportunity. Uh, nung bumagsak siya, tapat that was the bounce within the day nangyari. So let's talk about that still in a while. I'm gonna re- be writing IDC down. And so pag-usapan natin yan. Um. Asa na ako? And si Laura Lee Calderon. Good morning, sir. Web, CLI po. Si Web and CLI. Let's talk about them. Web, CLI. And CLI. There we go. Yayay, yayay. <laughs> Watching. All right, Michael Mendoza. Good morning, sir. Lloyd, uh, Estrella. Elmer, too. Good morning. DNL po. DNL definitely is always a buy for me as of the moment kasi napakamura ni DNL. Alright, um, Meron Jane Tang. Good morning, sir. SSI, BRN, and LR. Si LR medyo mataas na. Let's just wait for the retracement. But still, tignan natin ulit yung chart for everyone's uh, 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 consumption. Un- Uninani. <laughs> good morning. Lloyd Lawrence Aledo. Yun, sangay. How about STI, sir? Si STI naman. Very good. Uh, very good bounces lately. So, let's talk about STI. Pwede natin, tignan natin kung pwede man natin pasukin yan ngayon. Um... Good morning, sir, from Mark Tapang. Aris Pineda, good morning, sir, Lloyd. Or naman, thanks, yeah. Well, we'll talk about or in a while. Uh, Owen Benito, good morning, everyone. MAH, sir, from Michael Mendoza. As, uh, check out ma, kung nag-hold ba yung support. Si Mark Tapang naman, si STR. Uy, si STR, ang ganda ng galaw kahapon. We'll talk about that today. Uh, good morning, sir, M. White from Frentes Kid Rock first. M. White. And Arvin Nang, hi, sir, Lloyd. Good morning, good morning then. <clears throat> Ranulfo, um, Mm. Good morning, Coach. Yeah, Ranulfo is one of my students. And, uh, speaking of students, guys, magplug lang ako ng konti. I hope you've, you've earned this. This Saturday and Sunday, I will have an online workshop. It will be at 9 o'clock in the morning Saturdays, 9 o'clock in the morning Sundays. Um, if you want to help the channel, Help Financial Freedom 101 in return, um, by in helping yourself, um, join the workshop, guys. Napakaganda ng workshop. Uh, it will greatly improve your uh, uh, trading, especially if you're just starting off, right? You need to know everything you need, everything you need to know, and to start trading well. And as a workshop, right? It will be a very good investment for you. Hindi mahal ang workshop. It's very fair, a very win-win situation for me and you. Um, but yeah, then again, this is a good investment. Don't take my word for it about how good the workshop is. You can check out my Facebook page and then go to the ratings and doon yung mga testimonials sa mga comments ng mga tao about my workshop. Uh, check it out, right? Para makita ninyo. So mga hindi pa nakapag-join, please check it out, right? If, you do, if you're wondering how I am doing my trades, paano ko napapag-green ang, uh, napapag-green ang port ko, even kahapon na pulahan ang market, green pa rin majority ng positions ko. That's because... Um, of the system that I have and I'm teaching my system on this workshop. Right, um going back, um Arvin Nang, um yeah, Kidrock um na sulat na natin si MY. Arvin Nang, morning. Um IDC okay pa ba? Let's talk about IDC in a while. Sel- Selric Manuevo. Good morning. Ah, nga pala guys, October. Yeah, sa mga gusto naman na makita ako live, um, uh, it's the same workshop. It will be on October. Uh, forgot the date. <laughs> right, uh, it's organized by a group of traders in Manila. All right, I'm gonna be sending more information about it. This nag-upload na ng teaser kahapon. Uh, once the f- uh, today the details will be finalized. Um, I'm gonna be uploading more details about it on October. If you wanna see me live, it's the same content. Um, so na mas malaking group, which is much more fun. Right, and if it's a uh, uh, if you wanna uh, join that workshop. On October, you can do that. All right, just uh, uh, just wait for the for more. Ano, what? Just wait for more information about it. All right. Um, good morning, Sir Lloyd. CPG Tugs and Or from John Anderson Wong. CPG Tugs and uh, Or. All right. Let's talk about CP uh, CPG and Tugs. Right. And Solomon Yeban. Good morning, Sir. Good morning, then Lilian Sablad. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. How about ATN? Let's talk about ATN. Nasulat ko ba sa si ATN na? Uh, right, ATN. 
Hindi pa. So, good uh, good question kasi nag-break ng MA20 ATN, right? Arvin lang naman m Sir Lloyd, um, I think I wrote down m already. <gasps> Excuse me about that. So, uh, ayan. Uh, Asan ako? Ayan. Angel Vargas, good morning, Sir Lloyd. FGen, IDC, Alco. Uh, FGen, IDC, and Alco. So, FGen and Alco. Mm-hmm. Nagsisisi ako bakit hindi ko ni-recommend si Alco. I've been looking at Alco for how many days now. Ang ganda ng position niya eh. Um, kaso nga lang, I had to shorten my list sa top na gusto ko. Yun, si Alco pala yung bumili. So, <laughs> yun, sayang naman. Face good morning, Sir Lloyd. ALI and GFC, please. ALI. ALI and GFC. Right. Let's talk about that. Solomon Yeban, thoughts about CPG. F, uh, FRM, JCB, TBGI, sir. Let's write that down. Alright, that's for TBGI. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Ronald from Davao. ISM and OR. Ayan, si ISM and OR. Uh, ISM actually is, um, I'm recommending it for buy on dips, especially OR din. Si OR din. I'm um, just waiting for the bounce kay OR. Uh, once OR bounces, I'm gonna be uh, recommending it again. Uh, but, yun. Martin Samar, good morning. Annie Lin. Good mo- AM, CEI Pooser. Thanks, Sir. Ayan, si CEI. Yet I have CEI on my hand right now. Uh, hopefully, this goes up. Fundamentals are getting better. Kaya pumasok ako kay CEI. Alright, hipster trader. Tripster. Hipster, tripster. Ayan. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Robin, Jester. Ah, this is Robin pala. Alright, very good. Um, asan na ako? Nawala. Ayun. Sorry, nawala yung mga comments. Ah, uh, yun. Si Joel Mejares, sir, about Seb, napabili ako kahapon at 77. Wow, look at, uh, let me check. Uh, bakit kahapon ka lang bumili na umaakyat na? Alright, I'm gonna check it out. Seb at 77. Um, Raquel na says ito. Good morning, sir. BPI. Hindi mo ti... Uh, Si Mitch naman, good job kay Mitch, pumasok kay Seb nung nasa support pa. Laki na ng gains, di ba? Um, Raquel na says ito. Uh, good morning, sir. BPI, MBT, thanks. Yan, let's talk about BPI and Metro Bank. Actually, si Metro Bank, nasa lista ko ba? Yes, nasa lista ko si MBT. Si low risk pa. Inside sa po on Bloom, sir, from Solomon Yeban. Let's talk about Bloom. Alright. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Good morning, Elvira. ISM. Yeah, let's talk about that. Sir, morning po. Or po, MRC and MBT. This is from Randy Catalma. Uh, yung second is MRC. So, let's... Ah, uh, MRC. Andiyan na yun sa lista ko eh. Si Or naman, already there. And Big Mac, hello. Emmanuel Trino. Good morning, Food and Win. Yan, si Food and Win. Let's talk about Win. Nasulat ko na si Food. Si Win naman. Uh, Big Mac, IDC, Adrian uh, Belieca, good morning Sir Lloyd, CPG naman ins- Insights, uh, we'll already, we'll, uh, I already wrote that down, Tessville, STI po Sir Lloyd, thanks, yes, yeah, STI is there already, uh, EW, all in Quintanar, East West, yun, it's EW, one of the low risk positions right now in the market, good morning Sir Lloyd, STR and Geo, please from Adeli, Floretta, yeah, uh, STR, Geo naman, yan si Geo, ito yung maakit eh, Cas Lozada, um, Good day to all. Sir, hingi thoughts on TUGS and ISM. Thanks po. Ayan, si TUGS. Pag-usapan natin yan. Nasulat ko na yan si TUGS. Right, dadaanan niya, natin yan mamaya. Ar- also, RD de la Cruz, TUGS, and Popey. Ayan, si Popey. Especially Popey. Uh, Popey is in the support area already. I'm just waiting for a bounce before I'm gonna be recommending it again. But definitely, Popey is good to get into. David Gel. Right, sir, patanong po BDO, LR, and TUGS. Yes, nasa lista natin yan ngayon. Invalid daw, sir, Hong Kong yung YouTube link. Huh? Uh, Jose Mario Diaz, invalid daw, sir, sa Hong Kong yung YouTube link. Bakit ganun? Bakit bawal si Hong Kong? Bawal ba ang, bawal ba ang YouTube sa Hong Kong? I'm not really sure. But I think baka bawal sa Hong Kong yung YouTube. I'm not really sure about that. Sorry about that, Jose. I'm gonna check about that later on. Wag muna ngayon kasi baka masayang yung oras natin. Um, I'll definitely check that Check that out, Jose. Sorry about that. Estela Sanchez, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Uh, Gilbert Veles, good morning, Sir. Insights po kay SMPH. Yeah, SMPH, I didn't write that down. So, let's talk about SMPH. 
Alright, um, done sharing sir, thanks, yes. Thank you for sharing, yan. Please guys, share the video. May pag-asa pa ba si Bloom sir? Good morning. Meron naman pag-asa si Bloom eh. Alright, it's a very good company. Asa nga lang yun, nagkatakutan dahil sa yung news kay President Shipping, tsaka kay ano, um, President Duterte. So if you're trading Bloom, yeah, konting ingat, but if you're an investor, definitely look for a reversal and just buy more. Um, Harold Singyan or naman, yeah, we talked about, uh, we'll be talking about that. Ivan Desus ATN. Uh, Christian De La Cruz, good morning. Uh, Sir Lloyd, may buy average down ba or buy, uh, buy average down, ISM average down ba or buy MRC from Joel Garis. Let's talk about that in a while. Team Anora, Sir, may buntag Vietnam. Vita, palihog. Um, let's talk about Vita. Ayan, maraming naibit ni Vita. Kamusta yun natin si Vita? Um, Gilen, uh, Miguel, STR Sir Lloyd, we already wrote that down. STR Sir Lloyd, BB triggered? Yes, indeed, STR has been triggered, but medyo mataas na. It's already, it was an 8% gain yesterday, si STR, di ba? So, ang laki ng gain. That's a missed opportunity, but definitely is going up. So, let's just wait for the retracement. Atayin natin yung retracement sa entry natin. So, hopefully, usually the Bollinger Band triggers, uh, sparks an uptrend. So, yes, it's an uptrend, but it doesn't mean you get in right away. You just wait for the retracement before you get in. Right? Jao Umagap. Good morning, Sir Lloyd. Good evening here in Brazil. b and Nickel. Ayan, si b Ayan, topic ko yan ngayon. Uh, ISM. Ayan. Ayan, b and Nickel. Let's talk about Nickel. Uh, yan. Ari Spoon, sir, kamusta ko Bicor? Biglang bumaba kahapon. We'll talk about that. D- Dana Lucero, good morning. Harold Singyan, win po. Good morning. Michelle Obaldo, yan. One of my batch one students. Good morning, Mitch. And Dana Lucero, how's my ex doing from Dana? Let's talk about ex. Yan. Lapit naman puno yung lista natin. So, we'll be starting the discussion in a while pag napuno na yung lista. Ratchet is M wide, uh, WPI naman. Uy, si WPI, one of the winners yesterday. Yeah. Good job sa WPI. Medyo mabagal si gumalaw, but I already told you, it's an uptrend, di ba? Where do you wait for it? MA20. And it's doing good for you guys. Right. J Pasis, good morning, sir. Yes, good morning then. Uh, sir, comment po sa STR. Salamat po. This is from Maria Chona Bautista. We'll talk about that. Um, Opti Spark, Joni, good morning, sir, and everyone. LTG, uh, please, and dyan pa rin sa list ko si LTG. Don't worry about that. The, the, Teo de los Santos, sir, may available po ba kayong workshop na weekdays? Siguro, siguro, I'll be thinking about that. Baka next week, I'm gonna be making a workshop on the weekdays. Evangeline Velasco, hige, hey, meron na sa Manila. Yes, this is on October. Right. Hello po, bakit nawala si Or sa Reco mo, sir? I'm just waiting for the bounce ni Or before I'm gonna be recommending it. But definitely, yes, buy on dips it. Uh, si, ano eh, si Ore so you can buy habang mababa pa siya ngayon so don't worry about that uh, sa na naman yun uh, don't worry about that Giovanni right. J passes or ALI DMW and BDO wala si DMW sa list ko so I'm gonna be adding DMW right Frederico, hello, good morning, sir, from Bicor and AT, uh, Bicor and ATN. Let's talk about that. Angelica Galicia, good morning, sir. BRN and BS. Yeto, wala tong dalawang ito. Alright. No, ang haba na pa ng please niya. So, <laughs> yeah, we'll talk about that. So, Brenji Espanyol, good morning. How about SDR? CHP, Food and Fest. CHP, yan, wala sa lista yan. Si Fest naman, yan, wala rin. Ang, Ang nasa lista ko si Fes. Ayan, nasa si Fes sa lista ko. Right. Good morning, sir, from Camilla Lorzano. And ma... ma- uh, Pinoy Stock Trader. My sir, na kayo nang balik na ka dito sa YouTube. Right? Uh, Camilla Lorzano. Mas maganda ba sa YouTube kaysa sa Facebook? I'm not sure, re- really sure. Uh, I thought kasi mas maganda sa Facebook kasi mas accessible ng mga tao. But right now, I'm I- I'm having problems connecting with Facebook. Kaya I had to go back to YouTube. I had to fix my internet. At nakapag-YouTube live na naman ako. So, I think mag- may, para maganda feedback sa YouTube. Ha? So, yeah. Uh, may- maybe I will go back to YouTube. Mas maganda rin dito sa YouTube because I can go back to your comments. Hindi natatakpan. Which is better compared to Facebook. Yun yung problema ko sa Facebook. Eh. Um, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Benson. Um, Camille Lorzano. BPI, Sir. Good morning. Um, Benson Ma- Mausisa. Eh, sir. Sir Lloyd, how do you join the online workshop? Ilang hours po ba yung workshop? The workshop is two hours each. Please send me a message on Facebook ko. I'll be giving you the more details about it. Myra Lynn, good morning, sir. E-W-A-T-N-I-S-M. Yes, nasa lista na yan. So, I guess, yeah, we've covered pretty much most of the most of the requests. Um, Mel Dizon at the PIP. Hindi pa ito nalalagay si PIP. And then IRC in Vulcan from Fernando 
tablate so yun lang uh, this uh, puno na yung lista uh, vulcan and sino yung last irc yan irc so hopefully madaan na natin lahat yan so yes guys let's start but before that we want to thank our sponsor to trade asia um, if you're looking for a broker who will who is fast reliable and will let you trade anywhere anytime check out to trade asia ang ganda ng mobile app nila you can um Check it out at 2tradeasia.com And also eToro if you're looking for passive income Yung wala kang ginagawa pero kumikita ka with your money Check out eToro's copy trading right, I have a video about eToro copy trading And there's a link on the description of the video Please create an eToro account using that link right there Check it out, meron virtual trade doon If you use that link, you'll get 100,000 USD na, uh, na virtual funds And then you can check it out uh, You can use it for trading or you can use use it to copy trade so yes yun. um i'm gonna go to our chart now all right so first up let's talk about psei uh psei kaso nga lang yung settings ko nawala so i had to restart pala really sorry about it i, has, I had to restart my pc to test out the you know, uh, to test out the connection so psei kahapon was a very bloody day yesterday let me check out the details Yes, kahapon, walang market depth. Let's check out Investorgrams instead. PSEI, yun. Um, negative 1. Let me try to zoom in para lumaki yung numbers. I think this is much better right there. So, um, negative 1.64 CPSEI yesterday. Uh, when it hit 7,702, uh, uh, gladly it bounced it back to 7,751. But still a very big red for PSEI. Why is this? Um, yesterday, lumabas yung inflation rate ng Pilipinas. I didn't expect that. We were talking about um, PSEI yesterday. Uh, we did talk about the inflation going out. I thought that it was already, uh, what do you call this? I thought people were already aware. Kasi expected na malaki yung inflation. Na. There were news days before na around 6 to 7% yung inflation. So when it went out, dun pa talaga nagka-effect. I thought yung mga tao hindi na masyashock. So nagka-panic selling yesterday and everything went down to 7,700 but then again, uh, nasa resistance din naman tayo eh. Kaya nagka-sell off lang mga tao. This is a very good opportunity to buy stocks again kasi napakamura na. Look at JFC. Hapon ah, nag-buy more ako kay JFC. Um, 27, uh, right, 280 ako nag-buy more and yun, nag-285. So, oh, yun, those were the sales we were, we were, uh, we were expecting. Ang pinakamahi, Pinaka masaklap are the markets like BDO, the banks like BDO. Yun, laki ng red ni BDO kapon from 130 to 123. So, 7 pesos ang binagsak niya. But good news is that it bounced at the support and we have a bounce right here. Napakamura na ngayon ni BDO. So, I am recommending BDO again. But especially, well, most especially, wait for a buy. Uh, I mean, uh, a bounce, diba? Um, We'll talk about my top picks first. Yan. Top picks ko ngayon si MRC. I wanna talk about MRC. MRC. I'll use this kasi naka-itim nito eh. Mas maganda. MRC. I'm just gonna zoom in right there. So, MRC. I'm gonna delete the details right here. So, MRC. Pula si yesterday. But we discussed about this, about um, the investments. Um, kung hindi matutuloy si PTNT, dito papasok ang mga tao. Right? Um, with the bad news of PTNT, um, they're trying to recover. Babayaran na lang yung PTNT. But the news says that um, PSC is considering permanent ban already for PTNT. Uh, matatanggal na talaga sila sa PSE list. So if ever that happens, MRC will be the entry point. Diba? Ito yung backdoor nila. So that was good news somehow for MR MRC. Kaso wala nagkabintahan. But look at this red. Um, why is this red? Panic selling, I don't know, market sentiments, but we are support. Uh, we are at support levels again, and I want to show you this. That's why I'm recommending MRC. Kahit pula yan. Let me pull up my Timson. Ay, na-close pala. Uh, please give me one second. Just opening my Timson profile. I had this prepared kanina, but I had to restart PC. And a delay, so I had to open it, this again. Hindi uh, ko na na-open ulit, eh, kasi man, madali yan eh when I restarted my PC. But hopefully, it's here. Right, it's here. Portfolio. Um, let's talk about uh, MRC. Oops.
Alright, so MRC, I'm just looking at the uh, stock information. Yan. So, I hope you can see this. Kaso nga lang hindi lumalabas ang details eh. Um, dapat kanina lumabas to eh. Um, let me just uh, get the, uh, sa ano, um, let me just get the uh, screenshots sa chat room natin. Alright, sa MRC, I'll just use this instead. Alright, the daily grind and... Here we go. So I'll just use this instead. So I hope you can see this. Let me just go back to our uh, what they call this. And so on your on your screen right now, this is MRC yesterday. Negative four point fifty five percent. Yes, malaki yung binagsak niya. Point zero three. Uh, but look at this right here. Foreign selling zero. Walang foreigners na investor ang nagbebenta. Puro Pinoy lang ang nagbenta. Right? Um, foreign buying is 1.2 million uh, yesterday. Right? So that's good. Right? 1.2 million foreign buying. Uh, 1.2 million stocks. Uh, foreign shares, it's overall 3 billion. Walang binenta kahit isa. So that's a good sign for MRC. Right? Because they know something. <laughs> but yeah, um, they're, they they stayed invested kay MRC kahit na pulahan ng market yesterday. So that's a strong sign for MRC right there. That's why I'm recommending MRC still. Alright, um, MRC still buy on dips and nagdi-dip na siya ngayon. Let me go to the chart. And it's doing a dip already today. 0.63, right? Napakamura na yan, right? Accumulate na kayo ng MRC. Ganito kasi yan eh. Um, si PTNT, kahit na matutuloy si PTNT, if they come back, I tell you guys, hindi mga kapag hindi ka makakabili ng stocks ng PTNT it's not yet sure if the PTNT holders are gonna sell it even because of the news kay PTNT di ba so magkakaliparan talaga yan magkakaagawan if you won't be able to get in at least may MRC kayo kasi hihilain yan pataas that will be the scenario it's not a guarantee but that's the possible scenario um, pwedeng hilain ng PTNT si MRC pataas kasi dun, dun na lang yung choice ng mga tao kasi MRC is uh, 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 holds a large amount of PTNT. Um, ito yung gagawin lang uh, backdoor eh, di ba? Um, not really large amounts. I'm, really, I'm gonna do another research about that. Um, if may update ba nun sa hahawakan nilang stocks, I mean, percentage ng PTNT para gawin nilang backdoor ito. Medyo mahal magpa-backdoor eh. So, not sure if natuloy na yun. But yeah, that's the scenario. That's why I'm recommending MRC. Right, so MRC is still there. Um, buy on dips, especially ISM din, si ISM, right, um, nagpapasuka, um, nagsisipasuka ng investors kay ISM. Uh, Michael uh, Valdez, thank you for uh, subscribing. Yeah, kung magsasubscribe kayo, lalabas yung pangalan niyo dyan with a zombie, right? <laughs> Anyways, um, so, so for those who haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe. Right, ISM, ulit, um, uh, the numbers are not yet showing it. This is negative 132, pero pag pumasok na yung binayad ni... Uh, what do you call this? Ni Dennis Uy, yung Singapore na uh, investor who bought a, a big, huge chunk of ISM. Lalabas na yan sa numbers nila at maging, yung retained earnings nila lalaki. And yung parang, hindi retained earnings. I don't know where it will be coming out. Pero they will have funds for future na mga, uh, for future na mga uh, expansions. Uh, will be a lot for ISM. Malaki ang future ni ISM. So definitely buy on the dips of ISM. Next up is B Core. Yan, si B Core. Ito bali yung top 3 picks ko. Next up is B Core. Yan, um, it is at support already. Again. And B Core, ito yung sinasabi ko sa inyo, B Core is gonna be very good. Why? Yan, naglabas ng news si B Core. Uh, sorry, nasara. I had this prepared kanina. Company disclosures, acquisition of another shares and commission. Uh, company and so B Core and incorporated um, on August 16, 2013. Sem through its 100% owned subsidiary, uh, 7 Eleven Malaysia. Basically, is the owner of an operator of ano, uh, 7 Eleven Malaysia. It's the single largest convenience store chain in Malaysia with more than 2,100 convenience stores all over Malaysia. All right, so um, Bale, uh, Bumili sila da, asa na yun? Nawala eh. Uh, acquisition of a total of 6,000, uh, 6,502 shares. Alright, so may binili si B Core. This is one. 
of the ano. Uh, this is one of the big uh, news guy Bicor. And thank you so nag uh, nag nag subscribe. And um yeah, this is definitely something to watch out for Bicor. Michael Louis Lim, thank you for subscri subscribing then. Yeah, that's why Bicor. Yeah, um it's a very good at a very good position, undervalued plus this news and pasok sa bangayan usually. Right? Donnie Magbanoa, right? <laughs> good morning. Uh thank you for subscribing. And um that's why Bicor is in my top pick today. Next up is PLC. And then si PLC Uh, no, not PC. Uh, PLC. Yeah, so PLC is in my pick today. Sorry. PLC. Uy, maraming nagsasubscribe. Thank you so much. And um, PLC is still here. Uh, Dio Kanyate, good morning. Thank you for subscribing. And PLC on your screen right now. Uh, yun. It's at support. Yeah. Um, just wait for the bounce. Pag nag-bounce yan, that's another confirmation of support. Um, Second quarter earnings of PLC is very good, right? First quarter earnings plus 10%. So, this company has been improving lately and it's at a very cheap position, right? Napaka mura ni PLC right now. So, walang nagbebenta. A konti lang nagbebenta talaga ni PLC na lang. Wala pa volume. Kaso, um, but so, all you need to do is just position yourself at this, at this price right here. Napaka mura pa ni PLC. As of the moment, um, fest naman. Si Fes, uh, very bloody market yesterday, but it's holding on to that support right there. So that's a good sign for Fes. Just buy as long as this support holds for Fes. Um, definitely good numbers right here. Plus 304% increase on second quarter earnings. That's a very good number right, for Fes. Right. MBT naman, si MBT still very low risk. It's still at the support area. So, pwede pa rin mayroon si MBT. Kaso nga lang yung banks na apektahan ng uh, inflation right here. But why am I uh, choosing MBT? Because napakamura ni MBT as of the moment. This is the um, long-term support area. Napaka, yan yung pinakamurang narating niya in how many years. And we're at that point, place again. right? So, I don't think it's gonna go even... Uh, further down because Metro Bank is a good bank. Right? Palaki ng palaki pa rin si M Metro Bank. Um, so, MBT right there is in my list. NRCP naman. Si NRCP and Thank you so much sa mga nagsasubscribe. Um, si Carol B. Ayan. Um, NRCP, kahit pula kahapon, NRCP was green. This is the confirmation of a higher support right here. Very good numbers. Very consistent company. So, very cheap as of the moment. So, NRCP, position na kayo dito. Hindi ko naman sinasabi na mananalo ka agad to today. But definitely, pumosisyon na kayo. Alright. Thank you so much sa mga nagsasubscribe. This is the first time I've reached 503 viewers in YouTube. So, thank you so much. Jeline Tan, thank you for subscribing. Alright. So, mga hindi pa nakapag-subscribe, please subscribe to my channel. Yet, next up sa list natin, NRCP, guys, this is a very good company, very good position. Look at that. Bollinger Band is very constricted. Last time, it had a constricted Bollinger Band. Ayun, lumipad. Nag-constrict ulit dito, lumipad. Kaso nga lang bumalik ulit. But, NRCP is in my list. Yan. So, mga newbies dyan. And if you're looking for a company na hindi mawawala ang pera nyo, yan, dito. Right, napakaganda ng position nito. Start with low risk positions. That's why I'm re recommending NRCP today. Uh, next up, sa lista natin is Costco. Yan, andyan si Costco. Bakit? I can't remember why I placed Costco here. Yan, si Costco um, is showing higher lows right here. So, okay naman si Costco. Very consistent company. At Bollinger Band is very constricted already. So, napaka low risk na ng position ni Costco. Very stable price for a very consistent company. First quarter earnings plus 9%. Um, annual earnings plus 4%. Third quarter last year plus positive pa rin. Second quarter plus 29%. So, that's a very good plus for Costco. Definitely is improving and it's very cheap as of the moment. Napakamura ni Costco. So, definitely sit down on Costco. Anytime soon, nilipad yan. So, NRCP and Costco. So, mga newbies, yun yung mga pinapasok nyo dapat. Hindi yung naghahabol kayo sa taas. Right? Uh, yan. Um, APC naman. Si APC, I'm still recommending APC though it broke MA20. Right? Um, it's still at a very good price right here. Ito yung stabilization point niya. Uh, it went up because of this number. Plus 40% on second quarter and now it's stabilizing again at very near that area where before the, before the, uh, uh, what they call this, uh, before that uh, rice came, di ba? Yung pag niya. Andun pa rin siya, malapit lang sa area. It's just how many percentage difference right here. Yeah. So around 5% lang. Bali na, uh, after the earnings, 
parang 5% lang ginagalaw niya ngayon. So, those are very good numbers for APC. Definitely, position yourself, especially pag nag-bounce ito, that will be confirming that support right there for APC. Thank you so much. Ang daming nagsasubscribe. Um, Mark Las Bakan, hindi ko na mabasa lahat. But yeah, definitely, those who haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to my channel. Siguro, dito na ako magla-live everyday ulit. Um, asa na ako? APC. BDO, guys. Si BDO, antay niyo yung bounce. BDO. Wait for the bounce. Definitely a very good price already. We are at the support area right here. So most definitely magbabounce yan. But I can't be sure. Pero pag nagbounce yan, that is your entry point. Sayang yung entry na yan. Right? That's a very cheap price for BDO already. Hindi na nagbibentahan kahapon below that price. Right? Next up for BDO is LTG naman. Oh, no, sorry. LTG. And si LTG uh, recommended this yesterday. Yeah, nagretrace lang ng konte. Um, definitely still at a very good price. Numbers wise, napaka uh, stable ni LTG. Look at that second quarter, one forty one percent. Right, uh, that's a very good number right there. First quarter naman plus fifty two percent. Those are very good numbers, right? Um, annual earnings uh, plus twenty percent. So very very strong increases right third quarter 31 percent second quarter niya yes uh, last year negative nga lang but these are very good recoveries right here so getting more consistent now for ltg so this is a very good sign for ltg very good price for ltg napaka solid ng price na yan. it was consolidating at that area last year now it's starting to consolidate at that, that area again right so ltg for me is a buy already right these are very low risk positions so buy as long as that support holds Emperador constricted constricting na naman yung Bollinger Band so it's getting stable stable meaning pag pumasok ka kayo dyan napakalit lang ng chance na babagsak yan right? kasi hindi nagbebentahan pero hindi pa rin naman siya umaakyat so better position yourself there before the volume strikes right? so Emperador is there on my list Right. Emperador Primex naman Primex yan. Primex umakit ni bakit hindi ko natanggal si Primex dapat tinanggal ko to. this is already a missed opportunity for us I've been recommending Primex for how many days already at ayun na ay hindi wala pala talaga sa list ko si Primex nasa secondary picks ko pala yun right so uh, LTG Emperador PNB pala si PNB and PNB Mark Tapang thank you for uh, subscribing to my channel yeah, and PNB right here uh, did recommend this yesterday it did go down because of the inflation number it opened at a very good price pero nung lumabas ang inflation news pumagsak but look at that it bounced yesterday to back to 47.95 so overall I'm still recommending PNB bakit napaka mura pa rin ang presyo look at that MA20 is just 2.40% away so you can buy as long as the support holds for PNB right there. So okay pa rin si PNB for me. MWC naman sa sa list ko. Manila Water Company right here. It did an engulfing pattern. Look at this right here. This is a negative Bollinger Band trigger. If you haven't watched my Bollinger Band video yet, uh, please check it out. One, two, three. After the third, after three candlesticks, nag engulf siya dito sa red na ito. So this is an engulfing pattern for MWC. Now it just stabilized and look at that always almost all the time it stabilizes at the support and makes a support and we have a confirmation right here for mwc uh, this is backed up by good numbers look at that mwc positive naman yung second quarter niya first quarter niya is plus 16 percent so those are very good numbers kasi alam bumagsak di ba so that's still very good um uh annual niya negative but very small negative hindi nga nag 1% eh. so that's still okay that's very insignificant numbers but yeah this is a good position for a company that's earning well for this year right so MWC definitely check it out pwede nyo i-test yan napakalit ng risk niyan sa MWC RLT yan guys RLT I've been watching RLT still and it's still stabilizing right here so napakaganda pa rin na stabilization ni RLT so RLT Pumesto kayo dyan. Nap napakaganda ng position na yan. Buy as long as that support holds. This is a very good company. Plus 218 second quarter earnings. Right, uh, plus 124 first quarter earnings. Annual earnings niya. Look at that. Annual earnings. Plus 3229%. So napakaganda ng position ng company na ito. So definitely just check it out. Um, hindi pa naman siya gumagalaw. But maglagay kayo ng pera dyan. Huwag kayo mag-all in lang. Alright. Mamaya na kayo mag-all in pag uptrend na. Diba? The trend is your friend. Pag uptrend na yan, magiging kaibigan mo na yan. So, atok big wedge right here. So, price action wise is going up. So, AB is looking good. Right? Um, let's check out your risk. Right here. And AB. Right? The current position is 
around 4% away from the support. But these are very good signals right here for AB. So, pwede nyo lang uh, pasukin yan by as long as this support holds. This support is very strong right here. Ilang, ilang araw yan na hit yung support na yan. <coughs> so, AB definitely is something to look at. Lastly, sa list ko si Jerry. Right, Jerry is here. Right, uh, we have a good signal right here. Support wise, and this is strong support, a strong support for Jerry, and it's holding at that support right here. So it's at a very low risk position right now. Look at the earnings of Jerry for second quarter plus 11, uh, first quarter plus 26 percent, annual plus 44 percent. So the fundamentals of this company is improving. Right? So, ang ganda ng fundamentals ng company is improving. So, this should be one of the companies you should be looking at. Right? So, Jerry is a buy for me kasi napaka low risk for a good fundamental company. Ivan, so good, mo um, good morning. Thank you for subscribing. Sa mga hindi pa nakapag-subscribe, please subscribe to my channel. Time check, guys. It's 9.08. Ang bilis ng oras, ah. Um, ALI, unahin, um, I'm gonna go to your questions now. ALI. Alright, it's now at MA20. Right, ito yung sinasabi ko sa inyo, just wait for ALI to go to its uptrend line at malapit na siya. It's near at M it's very near MA20 already. So, this is a buy signal for me. Ayan, malapit na siya. Just wait for the green. Pag nag-green yan, you can test buy ALI. So, that's a very good position for ALI. Good job sa mga nag-antay. Next up is uh, SMPH. Ayan. Um, people are asking about SMPH. Yeah, nagre-retrace. At least sinasabi ko sa inyo, just wait for a breakout kay SMPH, di ba? Kasi if it doesn't do a breakout, most probably it's gonna be going down. We, um, um, sabi ko sa inyo, I think it's gonna break out, pero you can be wrong, di ba? So always trade what you see, not what you think, right? Antayin mo ang breakout before you get in. Kasi mangyayari ito. That's why I wasn't recommending SMPH for how many days because nasa resistance siya. Now it's going down. Let's just wait for the bounce. Pag nag-bounce yan, then that's when we will be entering. Right? SMPH. Um, BPI naman. Si BPI, ayun, nasa support na naman si BPI. But it did a bounce at the support yesterday. So pag nag-green yan today, that will be a confirmation. Pwede nyo pasukin yan si BPI. Definitely, it's a, at a very good price right here. Kaso nga lang, underwhelming yung numbers ni BPI is the second quarter, so that's why na hira pancho maakyat sa pagakyat. So I'm gonna I'm teaching you the entry of BPI. Just wait for the bounce, but I will not be recommending BPI because it's gonna be too long until the second quarter, nya second quarter numbers, nya. Ah, sa nako BPI or naman yun si or tinagal ko mo na si or sa list ko kasi nagre retrace pa. I'm just waiting for or actually nagbounce siya 1.24 so these are the dips we're waiting for I'm just waiting for one more green pag na green yan pwede na natin i-recommend ulit si or but yeah definitely my recommendation kay or is to buy on the dips and this is the dip right here Mar marami pang mangyayari kay or guys so definitely check it out pasukin niyo yan si or yan next sorry about that pause I was just <clears throat> gathering <clears throat> and looking at asa na ako. David Akuram, good morning. <clears throat> Thank you for subscribing. Food naman, um, hindi ko muna recommend sa food ulit ngayon kasi pumula right after yesterday but definitely is at MA20. Pag nag-bounce yan, pwede kayo mag-test buy kasi malapit siya sa MA20 right there. So, Palapit ng palapit sa MA20. So, get in MA20 as much as you can. Just cut loss below MA20. Just in case matapos na yung uptown niya. Kasi medyo mataas na rin yung ginalaw niya. Uh, definitely food. Um, watch out for it. Um, pwede pa yan umakyat. Um, we can't be sure nga lang. But definitely, if you wanna check out fundamentals of food, check it out just to add conviction on your ano, on your tra on your trades kay food. On your entry. Um, IDC yan. IDC. After yesterday's climb, umakyat siya ng 7.08, bumagsak. Eh, yun yung sinasabi ko, huwag niyo hahabulin yung mataas na yan. Eh, um, nakagain nga yung mga tao kahapon, pero it's a, it was a bearish market yesterday, so nagkachupitan and pumula. Um, IDC definitely is good to get into. Let's just wait for our perfect entry. Siguro malapit sa MA20 or... And somewhere near um, here. So, antay lang natin yung retrace ni IDC. Pag nag-bounce yan, that will be our entry point. Just wait for it. Darating at darating din yan. Huwag kayong maghahabol. Next up is web naman. Web is somehow still work us. Um, 
Still holding on to that support right there, si Web. So, so far, okay naman si Web. Just wait for the bounce uh, if you want to get in Web. Definitely, Web is something to get uh, to watch out for. Uh, after, actually, nag-wedge ito eh. After this downtrend, nag-rise konti, then this is the wedge right here. So, this is the wedge for Web. Na break niya yung wedge niya. So, it's just stabilizing. So, I guess this is okay already for Web. So, anytime soon, pag nag-bounce yan si Web, you can test out that support right there. Right. If you don't know what I what wedge I am uh, talking about, check out the patterns and may falling wedge na pattern. And this is a falling wedge right here. From a downtrend, nag uptrend sa glit, and then here's the wedge right here. Mikey Del Mundo, thank you for subscribing. Alright, so that's for web. CLI naman, ito si CLI, naabangan ko ito eh. Alright. Alright, CLI, after this engulfing, ito yung sinasabi ko, after the engulfing pattern right here, it just stabilized and yun, umaakit na. And then that stabilization right there. So this is very good for uh, CLI. So buy as long as the support holds for CLI. Oh, yung nga pala. Ito na pala yung ano ni CLI, stabilization ni CLI. Very good support right there. So CLI, yes, I'm gonna be adding CLI on my list. Right, pwede na pala ulit bilhin sa CLI. That was the confirmation that we were waiting for for CLI. Right. Hindi ko nga lang alam kailan uh, akit yan si CLI. But definitely, it's a good company. Maraming projects sa si CLI. Hindi lang dito sa Cebu. Right? So CLI has some very good projects uh, outside Cebu. Next up is DNL. Yan, si DNL still a buy for me. Right? Um, just wait for it to bounce. Buy as long as this support holds for DNL. Definitely a good company. Definitely check out DNL. Dapat kilala ninyo si DNL. So that you'll know why, understand why I am recommending DNL. Uh, SSI naman. Si SSI, ayun, kasi nag-break niya yung MA20 niya. This is what I'm talking about. na change in direction. I think pabagsak pa muna si SSI ngayon. So stay away for SSI. For the meantime, uh, but definitely a good company to watch out for. BRN, yan si BRN. Wow, starting to form a support right here. So, antayin lang natin si BRN. Um, waiting for it to stabilize really. Pag nag-green yan, that will be our confirmation. Pwede natin pasukin yan. That is price action trading and pataas na yung buying niya. If ever, mag-bounce si BRN. So, wait for the bounce. Antayin lang muna kay BRN. Uh, asa na ako? LR naman. Yes, si LR. I've been talking about LR for how many days now? Yes, LR is a buy. Uh, but just wait for the retracement kahapon umakyat pa siya so hindi dapat hindi natin hinabol may naghabol kaso nga lang naipit just wait for the re next retracement this was the retracement and then this is the bounce again this is three white soldiers so uptrend na tong stock na ito definitely good buy for LR uh, may lumalabas ang dami ng lumalabas na news kay LR na ano um, tuloy yung burakin actually hindi siya not just tuloy Actually, they're still constructing it. They're already constructing it. It's already, uh, they're still on track on finishing the project. So, napakalaki ng project na yun kay sa Boracay. So, LR definitely is a buy. Right? Pwede niyo pasukin yan si LR. Right? Just wait for the retracement nga lang. Huwag nyo hahabulin. So, LR is still a buy for me. Just wait for the retracement. Buy on the dips. Uh, STI naman, and very good volume yesterday. Nagkachupitan. Um, but yeah, uh, hopefully this is STI's, ano, this is STI's recovery. Look at RSI. That's a very healthy RSI right there. So this is good uh, indicator sa atin na pa, uh, tawag dyan, pa akit, um, STI is already gaining strength. So pwede nyo itest ba yan si STI ngayon? Right. I'm adding STI sa list ko. Right. Good job sa nag, ano, nagtanong. Akala ko kahapon hindi siya nag-retrace eh. Just notice today, if you didn't ask me about STI, I didn't notice this retracement, right? Bumagsak pala si STI. So, yeah, that's very good. Alpantum Vlogging, right? Thank you for subscribing. Right, uh, yun. Ah, saan ako? STI. MAH, yeah. One of the good questions right here, MAH. Uh, bibilisan ko lang, guys. Uh, it's 9.16. Right? Last 10 minutes lang as much as possible. Uh, we, we, we need to finish at 9.25 para makapag-prepare pa kayo sa market. MAH, uh, right now, pulahan siya. Kaso nga lang, it's holding on to that support. It's always bouncing when it hits that support. So, buy as long as that support holds for MAH. Uh, asan ako? STR naman. Si STR, gusto, um, gusto pasukin ng mga tao. Guys, this is a missed opportunity. The best entry for STR was right here. And yung sinasabi ko, just get in. Hopefully, it goes up. Yeah, it did go up yesterday. and it But the problem was, the problem is, that's already 8.64% movement. 
If you use MA20 as your support, that's 7.59% away. So that's a very high risk position already. It's some un un unsubstantiated move right there. So trend niya lang kasi napaka-solid na support. Um, just wait for the retracement. Baka mag-uptrend na si STR. So yan. Um, that's already a missed opportunity. But the Bollinger Band trigger is a signal for us that this might be an uptrend already. So antayin natin yung retracement niya. Pag nag-retrace yan and when it bounces, that's when you get in. Huwag kayong maghahabol dyan. Please, maawa kayo sa pera ninyo. Pinaghirapan nyo yan. Mm. Next up is MY. Somehow is breaking support. Uh, but it's a support area right there. So MY, mamaya na yan. Antayin lang tayo ng confirmation of the support. Kasi bumabagsak ng bumabagsak sa MY. Uh, asan ako? CPG. Yan, CPG. Yan, CPG, big red yesterday. But holding on to that support. Um, iwas na muna kay CPG. Uh... I, I know I've been recommending CPG kaso nga lang na-break niya yung support kaya nung na-break niya MA20 I wasn't recommending CPG anymore but always check out CPG just check out CPG's projects maganda yung project nila sa Palawan so that should be uh, pag may news na lumabas na officially about doon that should uh, make CPG grow but look at the numbers of CPG this is positive 24% for second quarter positive 2% sa first quarter Yan, um, it's uh, they're doing good this year. So CPG is something we want to watch out for. But right now, price action wise, it's not yet good to enter. Tugs naman si Tugs pumula kahapon it broke support, but it's still okay. Support is an area, not just a line right here. So okay pa rin si Tugs for me. Uh, when it broke MA20 nga lang, that was a signal na tapos na yung short up to ni Tugs. So nagsa sideways na siya. Let's wait for Tug Tugs to really stabilize. I thought it was gonna go up after the news. Kaso nga lang kahapon was a red day. So let's wait. Uh, definitely Tugs is good to buy. Just Let's just wait for Tugs to stabilize before we get in. Asan na tayo? ATN. Yan si ATN broke MA20 yesterday. It's now at 1.41. Um, again, the approach of ATN is for long term, right? Hindi chupita ng kay ATN, right? Uh, ATN, just buy more on its bounce right here. Uh, Malayo-layo pa mararating ni ATN. You have to learn, uh, you have to know, I want you guys, if you're looking at ATN, please study ATN, right? You need to know ATN by heart so that you'll have conviction on your entry. I'm recommending ATN for long term kasi malayo-layo pa mararating niyan, right? Uh, it's just that the price action, we can't really predict the price action. So, right now, after this solid solid move, ilang araw na green ni ATN, bumabagsak na naman siya. This time, it broke MA20. I'm waiting for it to stabilize before I'll be buying more for ATN. So, but ATN, yes, get in as an investor. If you're a trader, just wait for ATN to stabilize before you get in ATN. Uh, may nagsasabi sa akin, ATN, sir, sir Lloyd, sell na ba if you're a trader? Uh, sell 3% below this MA20. So, uh, you have to calculate your cut loss already if, you don't, if you're trading ATN only. Um, next up is FGEN. And ATN is a very good example of delayed gratification, right? Ang problema sa mga Pinoy is pagpasok sa market, gusto na nanalo ka agad, <laughs> right? It's not always like that, right? Stay put lang muna tayo kay ATN. That's my recommendation at least. FGEN naman. Uh, um, FGEN, <coughs> excuse me. So FGEN right now is retracing. Let's wait for FGEN to really stabilize before we wanna get in FGEN. Mm. Wag muna kay FGEN. Um, Alco naman, yes, si Alco, ito. Alang araw ko ito tinitignan eh because of the price action and the numbers. Second quarter plus 116%, right? First quarter, look at the first quarter number. Um, negative 135. This is what, the reason why it went down. That's why nagdadalawang isip ako. But on the second quarter, naka-recover naman siya. 116%. So that's a very good number. I was looking at this. Kaso nga lang hindi ko ito nakatch. So Alco right now, is at resistance level so konti ingat lang muna just wait for the retracement if you wanna get in alco if it bounces at a higher low then that's an uptrend that's your next entry point mm. 9.21 last 4 minutes guys bibilisan ko lang ito um, TBG uh, JFC and si JFC uh, JFC definitely still a buy for me si JFC napakalayo yung pa ng projection JFC is something you you be an investor in hindi yan for trading lang talaga so, JFC, malayo-layo pa mararating ni JFC. Right? So, JFC, look at that. MA20. This is why I love MA20, guys. MA20 bounce. MA20 bounce. Whenever that MA20 is broken, usually the trend changes. But right now, it's 
sitting at MA20, look at where it is bouncing. MA20, MA20, MA20. That's what that's why MA20 lang ginagamit ko sa MAs. All right. So, uh yeah. Uh it's still a buy for me actually. So, buy on dips to GFC. Right? Very good company. Ang laki ng tinubo niya no sa Pilipinas lang siya lumalaki. Now it's already expands expanding in the world. In the world, uh Philippines is just a small percentage of the world. Right? So, Imagine how much more Jollibee will grow if it conquers the world. And TBGI it broke MA20. This is what I'm saying. Pag na <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. If it breaks MA20, usually the trend changes and bumabagsak na si TBGI. So right now, TBGI, I'm not recommending TBGI yet. I'm waiting for the stabilization of TBGI. Baka sideways yung mangyayari kay TBGI or baka mag-downtrend, di ba? So hindi natin alam. And good example why I love MA20. Look at that. MA20 bounce. MA20 bounce. If it breaks MA20, then the train, trend changes. That's why I love MA20, guys. Uh, so you should check out MA20. Uh, it's been effective for me in, uh, what do you call this, in PSE. Uh, asan ako? TBGI, CEI. Yan, si CEI naman, still holding on to that support. Buy as long as that support holds for CEI. Fundamentals of this company is getting better. Right, look at that. 2319 increase in uh in the second quarter yeah so those are very significant numbers first quarter plus 656 right um annual report plus 911 right this company's fundamentals is getting better so better check it check out this company yeah very strong move right there and now it's retracing and the bounce and gen ccei so use the ma20 as your entry yeah Definitely check out companies whose ano, fundamentals are getting better. That's Warren Buffett technique. Right. CEB naman, good job sa mga pumasok kay CEB uh, dito sa support na ito. Um, it's already on an uptrend. It's doing a retracement again. So that's normal. Just wait for a bounce for CEB. Right. Mm. Definitely get in. CEB may, puma ay, may, may pumasok. Nakalimutan ko kanina at 77. Bakit nyo hinahabol ang stock pag mataas? Right, pumasok sa 77. Ay, nako. Right, just average down. Right, this is a good company. Whenever you see a bounce, just average down for CEB. So, uh, mag-average down lang kay, kay CEB. Um, dapat planado yung cut loss niya. This is a very difficult uh, position for you. Hopefully, it bounces. If it doesn't, hanapin mo na yung cut loss mo. Right, BPI naman. Um, yeah, we talked about BPI already. Uh, MBT, we talked about MBT already. Si Bloom, yan. May nagtanong kanina, may pag-asa ba si Bloom? But look at the price action of Bloom. It's holding on, on a higher low right here. So price is holding on to Bloom. So may pag-asa si Bloom, right? Definitely it has a chance of going up, right? If ever gusto niyo mag loss kay Bloom, just wait for it to go below the support if ever bumaba pa. But look at the price of Bloom. That's already very cheap for Bloom already. So napakamura ni ni Bloom for a very good company. Second quarter nga lang is negative kaya nahihirapan siya umakyat. But uh, definitely, first quarter niya naman, mataas naman. Um, annual earnings is very good. So, this is what I'm banking on you. Annual growth ni Bloom. So, yeah. Um, Bloom, may pag-asa naman si Bloom. Just cut loss if it ever if ever it breaks that support. Si Win. Right? It's 9.25 last lang si Win, guys. Uh, Win still uh, has still a very good projection for this company. Um, okay pa rin si Win. Uh, we have higher lows right here. So, yeah, by as long as the support holds for Win. Right guys, so that's it for today. Um, market PSEI projection ko today. I think it's gonna uh, bounce for a bit uh, and stabilize. Right, uh, after that strong downtrend yesterday, uh, I can't be sure, guys. So um, definitely stay stay invested, especially in companies that whose fundamentals are improving and are still very cheap. Yan yung sila aba, si aba na abangan ko lang yung bounce ni aba. Those companies are uh. Yan, si CLI, mga companies na paganda na paganda yung fundamentals nila. These are companies you should be looking out for, especially sa mga newbies. Uh, market ngayon, stay light. Uh, if you need to take profits, just take profits on half of it. Let the other half ride. Cut loss at your purchase area for para overall win pa rin kayo. Um, it's already 9.26. I have to stop the video now. Right. Once again, I'll see you tomorrow. Let's get rich together. Have a great day. Pasensya na if hindi ko nabasa lahat, ha? Uh, just join the chat room and I'll answer the questions there if I can, whenever I can. Bye, guys. Enjoy your day. Have a great day. Bye-bye.